an invite that never materialized. I was invited with my mom to a function, a very important function, because my mom's friend, uh, the daughter works in the biggest, uh, <laughs> should I say the biggest house in the country, the state house. The daughter works there. I don't know what kind of work she does there, but uh, there was that state function when uh, which the daughter invited the mom to attend and the mom invited my mom and my mom invited me I was a girl who was about 17 years old and I knew I would go to state house so guys you can imagine I didn't sleep I didn't sleep for two days when word came to me that I would be going to state house I could not get sleep because guys I was imagining that there I am entering state house and there I am seeing the president just in front of me there I am eating the foods in state house I was 17 I was imagining I'm going to eat a lot of meat a lot of chicken and I was imagining there's pizza I was imagining I would eat, I would eat cakes you know when I'm 17 I want to eat so many cakes I knew I would drink so many sodas and I couldn't wait. I was even imagining I would drink a Fanta, I would drink a Coke, no, no, not Coke, I would drink a Tarino. There was a, a soda called Tarino and it was orange, orange, orange. I knew I would drink that soda and I knew there would be juice. So I was saying, I'll drink all the juices that are there take so many sodas I was so excited that I'll eat chicken chicken I was imagining how many chicken pieces of chicken I would eat in state house and above all I just needed a cake you know the last cake I had eaten was at my, my friend's birthday party because my parents could not afford to, to throw parties for us birthday parties for us so we could only go to birthday parties of our friends and I had gone to my friend's birthday party and I had eaten a cake that was so sweet. Then there was that wedding that was in the village. The primary school in the village, in the field. And I get crushed. And the, when the cake was being distributed, I was very lucky to get a piece of cake. And guys, do you know that cake? To this day, I've never forgotten how it was tasting. That cake was so sweet that I needed to just eat a cake. I was just dying to eat a cake. And I was imagining the state house cake. How does it taste? If this birthday wedding cake in the village could taste that way. And my friend's birthday cake was equally good. How about the state house cake? So guys, I was imagining. So two days before the function, um, <clears throat> I could go to, to, to bed, but I, morning would find me still awake because I was just dreaming I was actually day dreaming and night dreaming at the same time during the day I was not even shikaring anything I was not understanding anything because I was just imagining that day that I would go to state house then at night I could not get sleep for two days and then the second night the day before the, uh, the function I was so sleepy so weather beaten so tired that I, I couldn't even open my eyes because actually without exaggerating I could not sleep a week a whole night for two nights that is like 48 hours and guys just the day before the the night before the function um, at about three o'clock I got sick in the night I think it was just because of lack of sleep and um, anxiety I developed high blood pressure and at night at about 4 in the morning I started feeling very light like um, I'm flying in the air and I, I, I felt I'm not well nauseatic I was feeling nausea I was feeling sick my head was beating up blowing up if I should say a very bad headache and I uh, when I called my mom, in the night I woke her up. Um, 
my fever had gone so high so um the village car had to be called so that i'm rushed to hospital and guys when uh, they got the car the vehicle at about five in the morning it was raining heavily and uh, even as they took me to hospital my pressure was taken you know when you get to hospital the first thing they do is they take your vitals my vitals were taken and my pressure was very high so guys i did not attend the function neither did my mom because i was immediately admitted in hospital picture that picture that guys picture that i was admitted in hospital and i could not go to the function neither could my mom go now my mom has gotten a patient so guys anxiety is ruined it all anxiety ruined it all anxiety ruined it all do you get anxiety bounce do you suffer from anxiety like i do to this day if i'm traveling somewhere tomorrow i'll not be able to sleep well tonight that happens to me up to this day please subscribe